Okay, someone wanted to know how I did it in Brilliance. Um, when you go and open up in Brilliance, just make sure you have your 5 by 7 hoop because that's what you'll need for the hat. So you want to scroll down. If you notice right here, it says 5 by 7 um, If I click on another one, it will say 6 by 6 And you can actually move um, your arrows up and down to find your hoop size. So I need the 5 by 7 and they go up and up in size. 5 by 7 I'm going to click Apply. Okay. All right. I'm going to click this little minus button here so I can see my whole screen. Now, when if you got the uh, applique that was suggested in the group, um, I bought another one. <laughs> Didn't realize that I could uh, go in here and you probably shouldn't be doing this, but hey, it worked for me. So, you see how I moved it? That's what you could do. And you just get when you get your rectangle, um, make it the size you want, click your A2. Make sure you're on letters. Type in the letters you want here. Click OK. And then I'm just going to move it here. Now, actually, I can click here and drag it over the whole thing. This little button right here is your center tool. So it's going to center it right there for me. Um, let me show you the font that I use. Sure. OK, I click here. And when I clicked on my letters, it told me exactly what font it was. Flare, serif, right there. Um, I may have made it smaller. Let's go see. Um, I'm going to say, now right here, I'm going to go find that font. Which was Flare, serif. Um, I am going to make it just a tad. I'm going to go from the corners just a little bit. And then I'm going to click, highlight it all, center it. And then what I do, I go to file, say stitch file because I want a PES file. Um, a working file would be the BE file, which is the uh, the software where you can go in and edit. If I do the PES file to put in my machine, it's not editable. If you want to edit it, you need to do this one. I do both. Um, so what I do is just get click save stitch file as, put in my jump drive, I give it a name here, and then I find my jump drive there. And I click save and then I can open it up in on my um, machine. All right, this is how I created the um, patch look uh, for the hats. Hope this helps.